Some 100 kilometers from Dubrovnik, with its charming old quarter and massive tourist influx from all over the world, lies the town of Metković. Located in the southernmost province of Croatia, it relies heavily on agriculture, but suffers from both its remote position and the growing competition from imported products. My family and I produce around 10 tonnes of peaches every year. Due to climate change, the harvesting season starts earlier and earlier each year. Therefore, we have a problem because we can't sell our products during the main tourist season from July the 1st. We have to look for new customers and new markets. Growing peaches only in his spare time, Nico mainly works as a junior expert for the city of Metković to help small farmers find new markets and improve the region's attractiveness within the EU project D-Rural. The municipality co-developed a virtual marketplace where over 120 users directly sell their goods and services. One of them is a blah blah car style shipping service for agricultural products. We're small producers who sell, transport and market our goods in Rijeka. This is why we realize that we can reduce our transport costs by shipping goods from other producers too. This makes our business cheaper and they achieve a better price by selling in other cities. Close to the Portuguese border and almost a two-hour drive from Seville, Los Santos de Maimona is a small Spanish city in the heart of Extremadura, suffering similar problems. At the crossroads of the Way of St. James and other walking trails, it boasts significant cultural heritage, but mainly lives from its agriculture and suffers from a declining population. In the nearby town of Almendralejo, the local community is ageing too, and for people like Joana, 93, even basic tasks have become a challenge. At my age, I can't even walk to the hairdresser. It's good to have one coming here, so I don't have to go out. This is why a virtual marketplace was developed with the aim of making a wide set of crucial services more accessible, which range from podiatry and healthcare to physical therapy. Estamos viviendo en un tiempo nuevo. We're living in times of great change, where the world is getting older and rural areas are seeing many of their inhabitants leave. La población en las zonas rurales. Necesitamos crear herramientas nuevas. We need to create new tools that bring people together and improve the range of services, connecting users in rural areas with providers who can operate there. Once the city and province are selected, the platform shows all the professionals available and allows users to book online the home service they need. Starting with Extremadura, this platform is set to be extended to the rest of Spain.